No, Karnakar. Are you able to listen my voice? Yes, sir. Yeah. Good evening. My name is Tripathaya. I'm a testing trainer in Arcos Infotech. So today I'm going to give a short demo about manual testing. Okay. Am I clear? Yes, sir. Okay. So today I'm going to a short giving to a short demo for you about a manual testing. So first we will discuss about what is software. In this software, what is software testing? In that there is a types of testing, manual testing, automation testing. Today we are going to discuss about these topics. Okay. So let me share a, uh, my screen to you. See, are you able to see my screen? Okay. So today we are going to discuss about a software. In software, there is a types of testing, manual testing and automation testing. Okay. Now, firstly, we will discuss about what is software. See, the software is a set of computer programs which helps us to perform a specific task. Okay. See, a set of computer programs means the programming languages which we are using in our software, like Core Java, Python, C++, .NET, we can use different types of languages. So it is a computer programming. The software is a computer programming which helps us to perform a specific task. See, by using the programming language, we can perform some tasks. No, we can we can develop a project or we can test a project. That is a specific task means. Okay. See here. Now you can understand what is software. Now coming to your software testing. What is software testing? What we do in software testing? What is the use of this software testing means? Testing is a part of software development. Okay. To develop a software, we need a testing. Okay, after completing the development of software from the developers, directly we won't give the software to the customer. Okay, they may cause some failures. It may cause some issues. So after completing the developing process, the testers will do testing process. This is what testing means. Testing is a part of software development. Okay, software testing is an activity to detect and identify the, identify the defects in the software. See, we can get some issues or some failures when we are using the software. Suppose take an example of Gmail application. When you are using this Gmail application, we can see the issues and errors. I mean, the invalid username, the invalid password, like that we can identify. So to rectify that kind of defects, we go for testing. After doing the development of software, then we go for testing. Okay, testing is an application along with functionality, with respect to requirements. See, I mean, with respect to requirements means the customer comes to the company. The customer meets the company with some requirements. Based on the requirements only, we can develop a software. Okay, after completing the development of software from the developers, the testers will do the software uh, testing, whether the software is correct or not, whether the application is working fine or not. Okay, next, the objectives of testing is to release a good quality product. Why we do this testing is to release a good quality product with a bug free application to the customer. Okay, the customer needs a bug free application and the customer needs good quality product from the software company. So that's why we go for testing. Okay. The next thing is what is the software quality? So the customer needs the customer needs a quality product. Is it or not? The customer needs a quality product. That's why he is in, he is interacting with the software company and the people are developing a software in the company and then we will go for testing. See, to give a good quality product with a bug free application, we do the software testing. Okay. So software quality means. Software quality is nothing but delivering a bug free application on time with all the requirements. See how the customer, how the customer knows his software he should be worked with, the, uh, with his customers. At that time, we will go for the software testing. Software is, quality is nothing but delivering a bug free application on time with all the requirements. See the application should work perfectly without having any errors, without having any bugs. Okay, that is what software quality is. Okay. Next overview of software testing. Here I have given a overview in software testing. In software testing, when we do software testing, in a, there are different types in software testing, SDLC, STLC like that. SDLC means a software development life cycle. STLC is a software testing life cycle. It, these are the step-by-step -step processes. There are different phases also in SDLC. 
like the requirements gathering analysis design of coding testing and maintenance like that the requirements gathering there are the different types of people in a team in real time implementation the business analyst and the developers and test engineers like that you have different types of people they will they will particularly that they will take care of these things okay and different types of testings also we can learn in manual testing like that white box testing black box testing like that see the manual testing means testing done by humans without the help of tools okay without the help of tools the manual testing will be done manually the human interaction is more in manual testing we have to write test scenarios we have to write test cases we have to do test execution okay in automation testing we use a tool to do these all things okay in writing a test scenarios and test cases is no needed in automation testing but you have to execute the test cases by using automation testing in this automation testing we use a tool that is called selenium okay the selenium by by programming core java is the programming languages we use the selenium okay next why we choose testing as a career option why because why testing is a more testing as a more demand nowadays in the it sector in a market there is a more demand for the testing testing is a gateway of the project why because the requirements gathering is gathered from the business analyst after the design will be completed and then the coding will is completed coding will be done by the developers see up to the developing process developing the software is completed then we can't directly release the uh, software to the market we have to test the software whether the software is working perfectly or not whether the software is fit for the customer requirements or not so we have to test the software whether is good whether the software is in a good product or not okay is so the testing that testing is the gateway of the project we as a, uh, imagine that we are a test engineers we are the real time employees in it sector we have to test after testing the software only we can release the software into the market okay so that's why testing is the gateway of the project testers is the schedule of the gateway okay testers will schedule when the project have to release into the market okay. after completing the testing with all the requirements in time with a good quality product that what the testers do okay software testers has the life with less stress okay why we use choose software testing is see uh, based on the developers the software testers have the less stress why because they have to develop a program with the requirements they have to think logically they build a software here in uh, testers uh, testers can't put that many effects okay here we can do we can the testers have the less life with this stress less stress they can have the testers related to developers okay testing does not depend on any technology okay the software development can depend on many more technologies like that we have this uh, languages now like java c++ .net html like that but testing will not depend on any technology software testing has high growth rate nowadays related to previous days nowadays software testing has a high growth rate okay software testing is performed either manually or by automated tools as i told you know software testing is performed manually or by automated tools manually means in our manual testing we have to do everything the person the human interaction is more in manual testing in automation that's testing the tools interaction is more okay the tools we use there is selenium okay we use different types of tools by using the selenium only by using core core java programming languages we use selenium there we have different types of tools log4j jenkins maven like that we have different types of tools okay and now now what is what is about testing okay in general testing is find out how will something something works so for example take an application take a facebook application or amazon application how the application has to work from the for the customer means based on the testing only the application will works okay based on the testing only the application will works from the customer in terms of human beings testing tells what level of knowledge or skills has to be acquired that means we are using a one application how the ap application is working okay how the application is working how the testing is done on the application that will do, do in testing only okay in computer we have different uh, softwares like means hardware and software development testing is used at key checkpoints in overall process 
see we have hardware and softwares as you know that but that will check in a key checkpoints like that to work a software application perfectly we will do our testing that is as a tester that is our job role as a test engineer in real time implementation that is our job role we have to test the application okay whether the application is perfect or not whether the application is fit for the customer requirements or not okay whether the application is good for the customer requirements or not we have to test that okay as a test engineer okay now coming to career outlook why we choose this testing means the modification and operational developments in manual testing are bringing to closer to the software development see in olden days dot the testing don't have that much demands but nowadays the market in the market in it sector the testing have more demands okay all the companies are searching for their test engineers so we have more demand in market nowadays okay the future holds promising the outcomes of manual testers providing they keep improving their skills learning the new technology what the it company think is they need a new skilled persons okay the person who have the new skills in testing or in any other developing process they think the new skilled person have to be recruited from the company so in this process we as a test engineers we have to be up skill with the testing with the manual testing or with automation testing by using different types of tools in manual testing we use a jira tool in automation testing we use different types of tools log4j jenkins maven apache maven github like that we have different types of tools we use so with that skills we have to ready for the it sector nowadays okay next coming to a salary for this testing uh, being a fresher there is a salary about uh, up to 2 lakhs to 5.5 lakhs per annum so as a fresher can learn fresher can earn this much salary nowadays in it sector this is a basic salary for a fresher and coming to experienced persons they can earn 6 lakhs to 20 lakh or 25 lakh based on his experience okay based on the knowledge of subject based on this experience can earn 6 lakhs to 25 lakh if you are automation tester you can earn more like more ctc okay next career options one specializing in a particular certificate course and other manual training is manual training you can apply for the different types of jobs see first you have done your manual testing training and you can uh, you can schedule your interviews for different types of jobs related to manual testing like automation testing data scientist business analyst performance testing performance testing nowadays uh, performance testing has more demand in market in it sector nowadays performance testing has more demand okay this is very important the performance testing is very important so nowadays the it companies the recruiters are asking more performance test engineers also next the quality engineer the test architect software delivery manager this kind of jobs you can apply after completing the manual testing okay uh, karnakar karnakar yes sir see are you clear about this uh, are you clear about this yeah yes sir did you understand about what i teach now yeah yes sir okay do you understand what is manual testing what is software what is software testing what is manual testing and what is automation testing yes sir how the career growth will be in manual testing i mean in testing side yes sir okay you understand about this right yes sir okay, okay. do you have any doubts no no sir okay okay thank you okay sir thank you sir. okay